warning. All stunts performed in this video were conducted by trained professionals in a safe, controlled environment. Do not try this at home. Super safe. What's good YouTube? Welcome back to another video, man. And today, we got something special planned. Peep drip though, you feel what I'm saying? I'm representing Nigeria right now. Shout out to the motherland. Do they got switches in Africa? I might got a supply. I recently picked up the Glock 21 from Walmart. If you missed that video, go back and check it out. And today, we are going to be putting a dot on it and taking her to the range. So, here she is, man. Ooh wee, y'all didn't even see the Chris Vector mag. My last two pickups were the Glock 40 and the Glock 21. Now, this magazine is a 10 mil Chris Vector mag extension. It only holds about 10 rounds, YouTube compliant, but it also works in a Glock 21, which is chambered in four or five. So, um, I haven't shot it with it yet, but I loaded up some uh, four or five rounds through it and they was they were cycling through so if it's cycling through it, it better shoot through so uh let me see this is this right here a four or five mag we're gonna take some four or five rounds one two we're gonna set it in the 10 mil mag and see what it do man so here we go one two we got two four or five rounds loaded in the 10 mil chris vector extension with the Glock 21. All right, here we go. One round chamber, ejected, chamber, ejected, and locked back. And you could tell it's in there. So, um, yeah, today, like I said, we are going to be making this thing more appealing. She already got the cut back strap. She about to get a red dot. She don't got no weapon light yet, but she already got the most important part, more rounds. Who needs a red dot and who needs a weapon light when you got more rounds? You see, the math is pretty simple here. If you only have a standard magazine, you're gonna wanna mount a red dot and a weapon light so that all your shots are proficient and precise and efficient and nice. But, <laughs> Oh my, oh my, good Lord, good gracious. If you have this extension, you don't need a dot, you don't need a light, you don't need nothing. Because if you can't hit one of these shots, that's that's user error, bro. There's no way you got a full mag and you miss. No matter if you got no optic, no sight, no flashlight. Now that I think of it, is that why all them YNs run no brace on their AR pistols? Hmm. Beats the piss out of me. But before we go to the range, we got to stop by Walmart, pick up a red dot for this thing. I don't know what light I want to mount on it yet. Um, I have a lot of old lights and some other uh, weapon light accessories sitting around the crib. But I am going to throw a Holosun 507C on it. So the light, I don't want to go cheap on the light. We're going to see though, because why do I have to keep buying all the expensive lights? If I'm not EDCing them, you feel what I'm saying? If it's not my EDC, then you not getting blessed with no damn TLR, you feel what I'm saying? And them TLRs is not cheap, you feel what I'm saying? So if you ain't my main chick, you will not get hit. You feel what I'm saying? I'm not finna trick on my side jump. You are not really my side jump though. I said I might EDC you. I might. Hold on, let me see what it be like. Let me see what that be like. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie, big brother. All right, let me take out. The 43X thing, I don't need no red dot. If I just load this mag up and I walk around like this, is that concealed? But yeah, anyways, man, she is going to be getting some upgrades today and we're gonna take her to the range for the first time. So baby, just get ready. Oh yeah, she gonna be busting. Just uh, slap this in my pocket, get in there. I got on them Atlanta skinny jeans right now. So they hugging me pretty tight, but the Chrissy will fit in there. That's it, that's all we need. Oh wait, can't forget the eye protection. I can't even see 15 yards down range without my glasses, so I need these for today. Y'all look at that box, man. Wait, bro. Y'all look at that box, man, that's hard. Think I need to sit with a preach, I'm still sinner, I ain't trying to get eagle. Tell my Glock, you'll never wanna leave me. Tell my Glock, you'll never wanna leave me. Yeah, nigga. Hooping all four seasons, nigga, get capped, they sending the bleachers. 
gun ain't never get dirty. Why the fuck you taking it to the cleaners? Shawty said she nervous. I'm real thug, baby, I ain't perfect. Allergic to the system, baby, I be ducking and I be swerving. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah. Let's get it, dude. I think I'm really embracing that YN role today, huh? Oh my goodness, bro. If you walked outside and you just seen this, like, what y'all thinking? Y'all gonna run to that car and lock it? <laughs> you really couldn't help yourself, huh? Glocks, Kool-Aid, and you just had chicken. Some stereotypes are just a little too accurate. I just woke up this morning, I'm loaded two IP twenties to start up the day. My bitch wants Chanel Leo. My mama just want me to stay out the way. She look pretty. She look pretty. She look pretty. I don't want people seeing the magazine and thinking that I'm I'm on time but I didn't want to leave it in the car because last time I left it in the car, y'all. Alright. I think I know where the dots are at. I gotta go all the way back to the firearm section and then go to accessories. Getting my steps in today. Why in getting his steps in today? Here go the mag again. Bro, stop poking out, bro. Damn. You scaring away the hoes. I'm not here to get nothing today, unfortunately. Uh I wish I was though. Oh, am I? Hmm. I might just get that 25 today. I ain't gonna lie. Nah, 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 nah. We're just getting the optic. We're just getting the optic. We're just getting the optic. Just an optic, Esau. I'm trying to work on my self-control. POV, POV cam. Okay, here go the red dots. Uh, the Holla Sun 407, 507K. I need a 507C. It's that right there in the back. Damn. Damn. 310. Yeah, but that's another G-Lock. But we gonna do it, man. I need to slap a dot on this one. So we gonna go ahead and get that. Uh, we gonna go ahead and pick that thing up, even though it called 310. Stop it, bro. It's crazy. I really wanna get another gun today, bro. It feels so awkward stepping in here and not buying a gun. Just the dot today, man. No, no guns today, just the dot today, man. The Hollison 507C. Closest to you in the back. Cool. Let's see if I got a brand new one. All right, appreciate it. Green or red dot? Uh, I prefer a red. Is there anything else here to Uh, that's all. I appreciate it. I'm really proud of myself because I really wanted to get another gun, but I didn't. I kept my eyes on the prize. We're on a time crunch. <laughs> I want to get that Glock 25. <laughs> I might come back after the range. Who knows? Who's gonna stop me? That's the thing, bro. Who's gonna stop me? <laughs> Everybody. Everybody's like, bro, what is he talking about? I'm just walking around saying, who's gonna stop me? How you doing? I'm good, thank you. You look good, too. <sighs> it's time for some hood engineering, man. We finna cook up red dot right now. We gotta make sure it fit, too, because um, I gotta make sure I got the right one. Y'all see it right here, man. We got the holla sun. Uh, 507 C. I was just talking all this stuff like, bro, I can't wait to record 4K videos. Let's use it, bro. Come on, man. I'm on an iPhone right now. I don't even know how to cut this thing on, bro. I'm still learning. So here we go. We got the Holla Sun 507 C. And right here, we got the Glock 21 Gen 5 MOS. We can go ahead and... Uh, Open that bad boy. Already seen the unboxing. We're gonna make sure she's cleared and empty. Brian know it came with no snack. This crazy. Eat the gel. I never tried this before. The camera better lock in, man. Here go the Holla Sun 507 C. Put that dot on me. You can choose what uh what reflex sight you want. Like it could be a circle with a dot with the crosshairs on it, or it could just be a regular dot. So, so you just hold down the back button and you just turn it into a regular dot. Y'all see that dot right there? Okay, anyways, it come with all the accessories. Let's just go ahead and get to work, man. 
We gonna be all right. We gonna be all right. What I told y'all, mm, we gonna be all right, man. I told y'all boys, it don't matter the place, the time, the day. Successfully mounted that red dot on the Glock 21. And we got that Chrissy. Now it's time to go to the range, man. Ooh, wee. This my new EDC. This my new EDC. They say this pain, so all I be speaking on. In the trap house, I'm in a spot with Adidas on. Stove open, got the heat on. Bro, don't stop till we on. Oh, you know we gotta go. Yeah, silhouette. You know we gotta go silhouette on this. Yeah, let's go. Let's go look a little pack on here. Hold on. Gotta bring your protection. Got my... Eye protection, ear protection, and extra protection. Oh, come on. We're gonna see though. What's going on, man?
¿Listo? Todo tuyo. Yeah, I'm straight long, I got cheese with me. Blows like that big hoe. Bitch, I'm straight long, I got fox with me. All right, so I just got back to the crib, and we gonna break it down, man. First impressions on the Glock 21 and the red dot. With this being my first handgun chamber in 45 ACP, um, I was expecting more recoil, but I felt like I was compensating it pretty well. The only time that I saw my shooting drastically uh, veer off target was when I was shooting with one hand. But with two hands, the rounds were going pretty much exactly where I was putting them. The cosmetics of the gun looks amazing. The Holocene was a great addition to the slide. It fits so well. The black on black, back and front serrations, the chopped beaver tail, the nice flaring on the magwell. And you know, I did have that Chris Vector extension. So, <sighs> Woman Crush Wednesday every day. She my WCW every day of the week, you hear me? She pressure, I ain't gonna lie, she pressure. My new EDC, I don't know, it's a lot, man. I am liking it though, you know? Uh, first experience through it, one through 10, I will rate like a eight, like a strong eight or nine. When I first got to the range, I already had the dot attached, but I removed it so that I could get some shots with the iron sights. Um, my first few shots, I was pulling left, then, I realigned and I started pinging that X from about seven to 10 yards. We did scoot it back to like 25 yards with the red dot. And that's when I started pulling left. You could see the grouping started to uh, slide over a little bit, two or three inches to the left side. So, you know, we still gotta clean that up. But with such a big round, um, you know, I don't expect to be perfect, but you know, it's pretty decent grouping for my first time shooting it. Um, you know, the dot was pretty on out the box, you know, Hollis, I'm pretty good with that. Um, looks amazing, bro. Honestly, like you can't ask for much more, bro. You can't ask for much more. I, I was starting to watch the videos back on my phone because I was recording off this camera, but the lighting kept messing up. I don't know why the lighting wasn't like catching me in the um, range. I tried to adjust it in there. I still don't know how to use this thing hundred percent. So I went back to the iPhone for a few uh, shots. And um, it looked like I was controlling the recoil pretty well. I was holding that thing. I'm not gonna lie, I like it. Um, if I was to EDC this, definitely wouldn't be the uh, Chris Vector mag though. 13 shots, that's already more than my 43X. Where my 43X at, baby? Y'all know my 43X holds 10 stock. 13 stock out the uh, 21, so we might got a contender, man. I don't know. But at the end of the day, I always feel like my 19X is going to be my ultimate EDC. I don't care about nothing else. 17 shots, no 38. I'm like, damn, she's fine. Wonder when she'll be mine. Oh, wait, she is mine. You feel what I'm saying? She perfect size, compact, 17 round standard mag. It got the plus 219. <sighs> Just just perfection right here. This is Glock perfection right here. My 19X, still my favorite. But if I wanted to add a new EDC to the rotation, it definitely would be the Glock 21. So, you know, unless I get the Glock 20, I ain't gonna lie. We still haven't got the Glock 20 yet. I do have the Glock 40 chambered in 10 mil. But if I were to add a third EDC to my rotation, I think we skip over the Glock 22. I just feel like the Glock 22 is very underwhelming to me. Like I thought I was gonna love it a lot more than I actually did. I don't know, it's just, it's not hitting like I thought it would. But you know what is? That Glock 21, so. Plus, my Glock 22 is not uh, MOS, so if I could throw a dot on my 22, it might go hand in hand with the Glock 21. But if I had to choose right now which one I wanna carry outside, I would go with the Glock 21. I'm not going to lie. Maybe I need to give the 22 another chance. Who knows? Y'all think I should uh, get an optic cut on my 22 and give her a second shot at being an EDC? This one I picked up from a pawn shop. This is dirty, bro. This is a dirty Glock 22. Got like three bodies on it. She got a smooth trigger. That trigger real nice. That trigger broken in. That's why... 
I'm used to shooting this down stiff, out the box, Glock 21 trigger. That Glock 22 trigger is smooth. I forgot. I forgot how good a trigger feel when it's actually broken in. That's a lot. That's a lot better than that. I ain't gonna lie. That's smooth. But like I said, I'm still choosing the Glock 21, man. Let me know what y'all boys would do. If y'all could EDC a Glock 21 or a Glock 22, what y'all gonna do? I could really see either way. Um, you know, maybe I just didn't get the greatest impressions off rip with the 22, but maybe we need to take a trip back to her and, and maybe give her a second chance, bro. She liked that one X that, you know, we didn't end on bad terms, but we didn't have the greatest relationship. Now, the Glock 21 is like that new side chick, but you want a wife her though. I want a wife her, but she my side, y'all. She gonna play the side role right now. So, this is my new... EDC rotation, throw it in rotation. So we got the 19X, we got the 43X, and now we got the 21 Gen 5. All them Jones got dots on them. Two of them got lights on them. I still gotta get a light. That's what I have to do. Before I really EDC this 21, I gotta get a light for it. Cause if it's gonna be my carry for the day, it's gotta be ready for day or night. It might be dark, it might be sunny, you need to have that gunny. You feel what I'm saying? I really got the same setup on both of my EDCs. The only difference is um, the handle it grip tape. I might still throw that on my 19X. I don't know. I really like it on the 43X, so we'll see. But I'm basically going to copy this same loadout and throw it on the uh, 21. So 21 Savage, we're going to go ahead and get that light soon. I just got to slow down because, damn. Bro, I ain't bought a Holosun in a few months, bro. That thing cost a 300. <sighs> but yeah, man, let me know what y'all think about adding this Glock 21 to my EDC rotation. Let me show y'all what it would actually look like. Stop pump faking with the Big Mag. We would really have it just like this. Now, I would have to get it inside the waistband holster. And if we compare the sizing of the guns, um... It is slightly larger than my 19X, so it's going to creep a little bit further down. And it also is thicker, so, you know, it's a little bit fatter, which means it's going to weigh a little bit more. So, and the bullets are bigger, which means the magazine is going to weigh more. So, we just getting a bigger, fatter EDC, like, boom. But... I might do it. It won't be like a an average EDC, but maybe like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Saturday is for the boys, you heard me? I don't know. I'm really just hyping it right now. Like the chances of me really EDCing this joint are very, very slim. But some days I might really feel like it. Some days I might carry that phone nick. Would y'all EDC this Glock 21 Gen 5? The red dot do her good. I need to throw a light on her. That TLR 7A is probably going to be a great fit, huh? I might as well just take it off this damn 19X and see. That's how we're going to do it right now. Mmm. Mmm. It don't look as good because you see it doesn't sit flush with the burrow. But, um, I mean, it's better than not having a light. I oh, don't know. I would like a light that extends a little further, honestly. Mm, it look better on a 19X for sure. This is the TLR7A. Ugh, ugh. Ugh, that 19X look ugly without no light. Ugh, I got so used to seeing it with the light, boy. Ugh, brother, ugh. I'd probably be more accurate without that light whole time. Them co-witness irons is so tough, bro. I got to throw some co-witness irons on my uh, 43X. That's the only thing that I don't got. Co-witness irons and maybe some porting on the top of the slide. Um, 19X, the same, maybe some porting on the top of this slide as well. Um, 
but I do need some cold witness for my fourth direction. And then we're gonna have to throw some cold witness on the damn 21. So two sets of cold witness iron sights and two slide uh ports. And a flashlight. We gotta get another weapon light, cause this TLR 7A don't look good on that down on that down uh, 21. 21 no savage. Ah, <sighs> there you go, baby girl. You look good again. I ain't gonna lie, you look good, baby. You look good. Yeah, I know. You look good, baby. Now we got them twin dots. Yes, sir. I got two of them 507Cs. Yes. Thank God. God is good, man. We eating good, baby. God is good, baby. Yes, sir. Draw down with them dots. We got dots on our sticks. Um, let me see if I can find a, a, a light to throw on this real quick just for the cosmetic value. Yeah, never mind. We saw what happened last time when I did that. Just to add some cosmetic value to the 40, I don't even, yeah, no. Nah. So, um, I'll probably end up ordering a light on uh, Amazon. You know, what light should I throw on the 21, man? Y'all, um, give me some recommendations in the comments. Let me know if this is a valid EDC. Would you EDC it? Should I add it to the rotation? Especially with the light, I think it's going gonna, it's gonna to make its way into the starting lineup. I think this is the current roster. QB1. Starting quarterback, Pat Mahomes. Quarterback number two. This is QB2. We'll call it a bit uh, Kyler Murray because, you know, he's small, short, accurate. And then uh, quarterback number three. We'll call it a bit Josh Allen throwing bombs. You feel what I'm saying? I think that's a pretty accurate lineup. So let me know if I should add it to the EDC collection, man. I appreciate y'all for watching. And I'm going to catch y'all in my next video, man. Guac gang on top. Roll the two milli, baby. Let's do it. My boy FGF pulled up on me, ready to get right, chat. You know what's going on. We live on kick, man. UNC grabbed a Glock 40. Live on kick, man. Y'all gotta tap into them kick streams. We be active, man. Now I got the TikTok live going. We got the kick live going. And we got the YouTube vid, man. We getting all the content. My boy at 12K on uh, YouTube. Y'all go subscribe to my boy FGF Inks. If y'all in the Houston area, tap in, man. Get y'all some ink. Y'all see what we got going, man. Yeah, my boy got me right. Had to connect the chest and the shoulders, man. I live streamed it all on kick, man. If y'all missed it, y'all missed out. Got right, man. Look at that. Good work. Good work. Good work. Shout out to my boy FGF, man. You know what the fuck going on, man. Go follow me on Instagram and on YouTube at FGF underscore inks and FGF inks on YouTube. Tap in on the tube, man. Get him to 100K, man. Run him up. Y'all see what's going on, man. He got some five content. He got some blicks too. It's not just tax, but he got inks. He got them sticks. Tax, guns, and vlogs. Tax, guns, and vlogs, man. Y'all gonna like that content. So y'all tap in. He got me right, man. I'm finna get back up with him soon. I gotta finish the rest of my arm. I gotta get some more ink, man. I feel like I gotta get my neck. Nah, damn, I feel like. Yeah, all that empty space up here. Nah, I feel like I gotta keep going. But nah, for real though, y'all tap in. Stay tuned, man. Thanks.